Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. For those of you who don't know, my name is Sarah. For those of you who do, hey! So today's video is going to be in this little bundle of clothes and everything cost us between 50 pence and a pound, no more. Now this is a bundle of either vintage or really weird, obscure looking items that James thought were really cool and just wanted to show off. So I think there's only two items in there that are obscure, the rest are vintage. We've kept the best item. Tell me that now. Yeah, I told you that two seconds ago. You told me you didn't tell me two. Yeah, there's only two items that are a bit obscure. They're all vintage, and the very best item I think we've kept to the end. Okay. And I forgot to say as well. Um, when you're buying stock to sell on eBay, you have to be very careful in the price you pay because the cost of goods can set how much you're going to sell the item for. So if you're paying three, four pound an item, you've got to remember there's always people out there finding the same item for fifty pence to a pound. So, as you'll see, we have paid very little for these items. Yeah. So let's show the first one. Have you even checked? We haven't checked any of these. Um, we haven't done any research. We haven't checked sold. So we're not sure. Yeah. About these items. This is a, a weird, weird top, isn't it? Watson's. It feels horrible. It it's feels like a woolly, really. Thing. We've got a Pendleton shut up, and it feels like that sort of material. It's like, oh, really old. I know. It's like a shirt or a jacket or a jumper. I'm not sure. It's a sh I don't know. It's like a shirt, really fucking heavy. Watson's heavies. Hmm. I don't know, but it feels. I don't know if you can see the thickness of that. It feels really heavy, and it's horrible. Can you see the buttons? There's something on the buttons. Really old looking buttons as well. Hmm. It's not a nice feeling, is it? Mm -mm. Do you not mind it? Me. Oh. Yeah. Is that a Pendleton top we've got? I hate the feel of it. I don't even know what top that is. This is the old shirt for the 60s or 70s we've got listed. I've got listed for like 150 something like that. No, I'm not keep going. <laughs> okay, so this one is Regatta. Kind of looks like a shell suit. Great outdoors. This is quite heavy. Yeah. I'll show you the label. Size 14, so it's a women's mm. jacket. Yeah. Nice shell suit style. Um, Lakers t shirt, NBA. Let's see if I. Ring the back. And ring the back. So, our friend loves um, basketball, and he told us LeBron James the number six is rarer because he retired that number or something for a deaf ear player. So that number got retired, so if you find LeBron James 6, it's a bit more rare. Okay, Kickers. Definitely old school. It's never like when we were starting to. Yeah, when we yeah. started dating, I had a few kickers tops, which I actually sold on eBay. Yeah. <laughs> not too long ago. <laughs> now, to one of the obscure tops. Okay, this is like a pimp style or something, isn't it? <laughs> You just see some dude wearing this way, like his hairy chest hanging out and some gold chains and stuff. I think you've been watching too much TV, Sarah. <laughs> yeah. Something in the back, it's like, it's like really sp shiny, sparkly gold, that floral print. It's got bits of brown and black, black and yellow and gold. <clears throat> this is a corset, corset. Waist tightener, waist adjuster, what's the board? I think it's a, I think it sucks your yeah. person, isn't it? It's supposed to go around you. Like a body? Mm -hmm. Like a, I don't know what you call it now. It wouldn't even fit around me, I don't think, but <laughs> you're supposed to have it round. Oh, sugar, fucking fine down there. Suck your belly in. Yeah. God, it doesn't fit me. <laughs> <laughs> but some women wear these and then they get ones where you can actually tighten them, like every couple of days, and they just tighten them and they end up with that weird, like, hourglass. Shape. What? So. What brand's that? Yanni or something? It is Yanni. Oh, I think I'd look it up. I'm gonna go for twenty to twenty-five. <laughs> That's a large. Shut up. That's what size, sir? Do you even fit you? Extra, extra. Oh, you need a two XL then. <gasps> I'm wearing a really thick jumper. I'm very cold today. Cold shrinks doesn't expand. Should I say you're very hot today? That's why I'm wearing a jumper. So the jumper's the reason. <laughs> this this looks like something from the, like Life on Mars, 1960s footballer. Would wear. This doesn't fit me anyway, but oh god, how ugly is this jacket? Actually, I like that jacket. It's quite nice. Reminds me of something my mum used to wear when I was a wean. 
a perfect jacket for the shed. Yeah. If you couldn't move it, I wasn't trying to take the least. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that matches what I'm wearing today, doesn't it? It doesn't fit you. <laughs> it does look like it matches what you're wearing. Oh my god, it's so ugly. I like it. Oh, no, it totally reminds me of my mum's jacket from when I was a kid. Hold on. She had something like this. Oh, is it Nikki? How it feels? Genuine sheepskin. Oh, I like that jacket. I held on to that for way too long there. Ugh. Now that's a horrible feeling. <laughs> Set that in my way. Another obscure shot. Yeah, it's like suns or something. Yeah, we got sundial or something like that, isn't it? Yeah. Um, 2XL. Brands it. Zhang Ying. <laughs> This this feels like a towel. Yeah, it does. Haley has. It feels like the the cloths you get like a non. non uh, the weird called. fabric ones that are supposed to be like for like they don't like the wet the wetness sticks in them. Non-static or yeah. something. Like a rubbish tea towel on in the kitchen. And it's Haley Hansen, as you can see. And Dig London, so a nice leather jacket. It smells the smoke. Yeah, it stinks, doesn't it? Yeah. It's like something out of the Matrix. I'm back. She's I'm back. Quite a long leather jacket. Oh my god. It's reeking the smoke in it. It's yeah. clean. Genuine leather product. Oh, stinking. Yeah. Oof, that is really smelly. And this one is. Is there a name somewhere? Harris Tweed. There's no label on it, but we've got the match in the hat to go okay. with it. So, Harris Tweed suit jacket. I think the label's been cut off, but there is a matching Harris Tweed, um, would you call it, flat cap? Oh, okay. I thought it was a big stain, but it's not to my shadow. Sorry, and that's what I was see moving up about. See the label inside matches the hat. Okay. So we'll probably sell them as a set. And last but not least, the There's Discovery one I think Channel. Off the most money. Where's the label? Logo. I don't like how this feels neither. So I can't find any of these on eBay, so I don't know. I'll probably aim for over £100. Mm. As you can see, it's got the weird little world, which is kind of... I don't know what you call it. But if it was, if it was no made nowadays, the world would be a lot more detailed on it. It's like, like smudged. Mm -hmm. Can we see the front again? You even nail it. Doesn't look detailed at all. Mm. But we have looked up in um, this jacket. And the vintage ones do have the same level, so it's definitely vintage. Ooh, I don't like how it feels and I have to list them. Ooh. I'll give them all a wash, obviously. They don't feel like getting me wash them. Yeah, they will. It's the material I don't like. I thought it was the dustiness. You feel no, like not the actual. Like, I don't like the touch of that. I don't like this. That one. <laughs> okay, that is it for our weird and obscure and vintage style. So what item was your favourite? Yeah. Actually, I think my favourite would be... Either the sheep skin jacket or the Discovery Channel jacket. Would mm -hmm. just be Sarah? I don't know, I forgot what we just looked at. <laughs> <laughs> well, probably the Discovery jacket because I like the Discovery Channel. <laughs> I like all the wee documentaries. Um, okay, so that is it for this video. Um, let us know what your favourite was at the bottom. Say hi. Just anything you guys want to talk about, just put them in the comments below because below below because we like hearing from you guys <laughs> see i can't stop moving just answer the pants yeah um okay so that's it for this video um if you liked it please think about hitting the thumbs up if you haven't already think about subscribing i forgot the word <laughs> hitting that bell for more of our videos and until next time guys bye